Open drug dealing, violence and theft. For many, the city centre has become a no-go zone when the sun goes down. Dublin After Dark follows a Garda unit showing exactly the challenges members face while patrolling the streets of the capital. When the Garda get the body cams, I think and I'm going to anticipate that the judiciary are going to be shocked when they see the level of vitriol that's directed at the guards and what they have to put up with. It's very worrying to see that assaults on Gardaí have increased and of course for us in AGSI what we worry about is that society becomes tolerant of that kind of behaviour. And those trying to make a living in the city centre are becoming increasingly frustrated at having to regularly call Gardaí to deal with antisocial behaviour. What I know from looking outside the window is that the war on drugs is not working. You can buy, sell and take drugs openly. Those within on Garda Síochána say its efforts are often hampered by bureaucracy and a shortage of members. Let the guards go out. We want to do our job. The things that are stopping us are actually, a lot of them are internal processes and what's been sold as progress is actually diminishing our presence on the street. Last September there was outrage when this footage of a Garda car being rammed in Cherry Orchard went viral. Some said it should be a wake-up call, that it's time to get a handle on antisocial behaviour in the capital from those who appear to fear no repercussions. Hannah Murphy, Virgin Media News. And you can watch that documentary at 10 o'clock here on Virgin Media One.